against arts. It's just how are they going to be funded? And we say for every dollar spent on the arts by the NEA, seven dollars comes back to the community, and you can't beat those economic development odds. Hey, we have a lot of um, allies on both sides of the aisle who recognize how important the arts are to American culture, and um, so I, I am optimistic, but I am not relaxed. So we're here to uh, try to stave off the president's desire to erase um, the funding completely. And Congress has shown uh, pretty good um, strength in uh, actually increasing the budget last year. And uh, we were talking to some members today. Oh, it's just been absolutely wonderful meeting with senators and the politicians and really getting an understanding of how things work around here and seeing how much support the arts actually have. I think everyone sees the value in it. And it was really just wonderful to be part of the conversation. We had a great morning this morning talking to a bunch of people on Capitol Hill. And we heard some great support. Um, and we learned some more facts about how art therapy is really um, it's really a great thing that uh, the endowment funds. I was really uh, pleasantly surprised at how receptive uh, everyone was and it seemed like everybody could relate to it on a personal level and knew how important the arts are in our education system. It's one of the best parts about being a celebrity is being able to um, talk about things that I'm passionate about and try and make a difference in any small way that I can. My husband and I are both a political, you know, we're political nerds, we, we're, we're junkies, so it was really exciting to see it in, in how it was just working on a day-to-day -day basis and really get to meet the people that sit down and, and work uh, legislation and, and important policies and I just wanted to thank them for their work. Money will always follow the arts. Not to mention that in the education area, it keeps kids in school. Uh, it helps to think creatively. They don't necessarily become artists, of course. That's not the point. It's an ongoing chaos, and uh, I don't know. We're just trying to kind of bring bring one little piece of the puzzle to the you know to the forefront, which is um, you know funding the arts. The budget for the military band is four hundred thirty-seven million dollars for military bands. The bu budget for the National Endowment for the Arts is one hundred fifty-three million. So. It's, we're still not funding the National Endowment for the Arts that includes every congressional district in the entire United States. And until we uh, get that into a place where it's more comfortable, I'm not going to rest.